Ave Maria, brothers and sisters. I would like to share this quick update regarding the envoy. Luz de Maria's latest message mentions my envoy will arrive after the appearance of the Antichrist and my children will recognize him. And if we go down to the footnotes of this message, we see an explanation concerning God's envoy. And there's a whole PDF document that show <coughs> messages, past messages from Luz de Maria regarding the envoy. And I'm going to read a few of them of what just so the envoy is referring to. The angel of peace, the one sent by God. Revelations and prophecies given to Luz de Maria. My beloved Christ, your God, will send help to my people. I will send one who is angel of peace, a creature who lives in my, beloved, in my love and is nourished by my love. My people need my envoy so they will not be lost amid such bloody spiritual battles. 2016. Every generation has always been blessed. Children do not fear, do not fear. I will send from heaven, from above, my legions to defend my church and with them I will send you a defender who will fight against evil and against the Antichrist and will defeat him. 2013. A creature of God will come to help you in the most critical instance and the instance of persecution. He will be sent from on high to help the faithful and will have the word in his mouth so that you do not falter in faith. This creature will be salvation for the mystic body of my son and will be a blessing for those who expect to be helped directly by heaven. And here again, our current generation. This rebellious generation has in their hands the greatest responsibility that I have given to human creatures since this generation will face the warning and will witness the fulfillment of the prophecies given by my mother throughout the history of humanity. This generation will see my angel of peace. This generation will live the greatest chastisement, worse than even the flood. But at the same time, those faithful will be blessed with the greatest miracle that my house has ever given to any creature. I'll read a couple more, brothers and sisters. Now, understand and accept the reality in which we live. Keep in mind that this is not the end of the world, but of this generation, which is why you are facing such chaos caused by disobedience regarding my revelations, those already fulfilled, those being fulfilled and those about to be fulfilled. The devil knows this and being aware of it, he has unleashed his fury against my children in order to lead them to damnation. The Antichrist has emerged and acts from earth, from among men, from the earthly powers, political and powerful. He will have power over what is religious and political. After the great events and the purification of our people, I will arrive in my second coming. Awaiting the angel of peace. Wait for the angel of peace whom I am prote protecting until the instant in which my son sends him to the earth. I know that for some people my revelations are not too much. That is why I have revealed this secret to my prophet waiting for a reaction from humanity. Precursor to the second coming of Christ. How much this generation has changed by falling into the hands of the devil in being pulled along the, by the powerful who have united in order to lead this generation to prostrate itself to the feet of the Antichrist. That is why I invite you once again to look up so that you do not forget that you belong to the Father's house, not to the false ideologies growing at this instant over the earth. Therefore, 
after the Antichrist appears publicly making himself known not by himself by through his hench but through his henchmen the angel of peace will come from the father's house is not a prophet but the one I have announced over the years in my previous apparitions how would the father's house abandon his children and not reach out to them no children the father's infinite love for each one of his human creatures once more stretches out and overflows in love and mercy and sends his assistance from his house which will prepare the faithful people for the second coming of my son to earth so it is a great message of joy brothers and sisters that the messages of this envoy or the angel of peace is really a great consolation and a help for the people of God in these times of despair, panic, persecution and times of evil. So do not forget that my help will arrive before my second coming. Help will arrive from the paternal house and in your midst he will be the mirror of my son's love. He will keep you in faith, hope and charity until my son arrives in his second coming to earth. My mother prepares my second coming and she, by her hand, will bring my angel of peace to my children so that he gives you my love, my guidance and sustains you. I will send my angel of peace. You should pray for him. Pray with the praxis of love towards your brother so that there might be peace in homes, peace in persons of goodwill. My angel of peace will gather you in the one flock. He will protect you with my word. My people are not alone. My angel ought to be waited for appropriately by preparing yourselves spiritually, being those who accomplish my will and obeying the commandments, but above all, living in my peace, my love, my charity, in my hope, fighting the evil that wants to disperse you. My angel reunites and is already suffering because of humanity's ignorance, especially because of the acts of those who will stay by his side on earth. Today I present the angel of peace to humanity, a new creature, a creature instructed by the most holy trinity, a creature who in the likeness of John the Baptist will cry out even in the desert of this generation so that you would return to and continue the path towards salvation. We pray, dear Lord, for this second John the Baptist to come and prepare the way of the Lord. Brothers and sisters, this is a 16-page document. There's a lot to go through. I won't read it all, brothers and sisters. But instead, I will leave the link for this document in the descriptions. God bless you and let us rest the hope of the Lord. Amen.